A million dollar surprise of a lifetime for a Michigan woman. Thanks for joining us here at 530. I'm Colleen Borman. Now you've probably seen the prize patrol from Publishers Clearinghouse on TV, but today one Constantine Michigan woman had to see it to believe it. She was paid a visit and now she is paying it forward. Only on ABC 57 News here at 530, Vahid Sadrazadi shows you the behind the scenes look of the big day. We've all seen the reactions on TV, the checks, the smiles, the winners. Today, reality TV rolled into the small Michigan town of Constantine to dole out a whopping $1 million to one lucky winner. Neighbors help us. Uh, social media sometimes can give us a clue where we can find the person, uh, where there are friends and relatives. So we always deliver our prize. Well, you see these guys over here? They came all the way from Long Island to surprise Betty, who's in her early 60s, with the grand prize of a million dollars. You see the balloons there in the back of the car. The prize patrol is out and about. We're going to follow them right now as Betty is about to get the surprise of a lifetime. And we were off. Betty's house, only a 10-minute drive. But it turned out Betty wasn't home at all. So what was plan B? I have a phone number. We'll try that. Now the chase was on. We followed PCH to Constantine High School, where Betty is training to become a bus driver. Betty, come here. Come out here. Hi, Betty. Step Hi, on Betty. out. Come on. Oh, oh, my something God. else. We are here to give you a million dollars. Oh! <laughs> this is not true. <laughs> yes, you can retire, okay? Betty. No, no, no. Oh, you are real. This is, funny, no, this, is this is real. 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 You want a million dollars to fuck this? This is actually true. You've seen this on TV. Yeah. You can get the roses. Yeah. What do you think you're going to spend some of this money on? Uh, taxes. <laughs> taxes, yeah. Taxes. <laughs> can, can I just run? Uh, well, your dogs. <laughs> yeah. My dogs, my dogs, and my cat just had lots of surgeries, and it was lots of thousands. Your boss is worried that you might not. If you're interested in driving a bus anymore, are you going to pursue that still? I will, I will still do it, but I hate failure. <laughs> that one, that A1 type personality, I just, I have to be perfect, buddy by the book, as I was known. This is rough, so. It's a, it's a perfect Christmas gift, isn't it? I can't believe it. In Constantine, Michigan, Vahid Sadrazadeh, ABC 57 News.